are listening to Coastline by Australian duo Hollow Coves. The band is hitting the road this summer, but the tour is not just to perform their music. They're also raising money to protect our natural world. They're teaming up with the National Parks Foundation with a portion of their ticket sales going towards the cause. And joining me to tell us all about the initiative and their upcoming shows is Ryan Henderson and Matt Karens of Hollow Coves. Welcome. Thank Thanks you. Thanks so much. It's good so, to be here. So what have I been doing this morning but listening to your album? Oh, it's really good. So it's you. so calming. It does make you think of nature and the beach and um, and also your new album, which is what I was listening to, Nothing to Lose is out. Congratulations. Thanks so much. Yeah, we're Thank really you. excited about this one. Tell us about it. Um, yeah, so we recorded it with a producer in Australia um, who is actually, uh, yeah, like an inspiration for mm. us. Um, his name is Matt Corby. So, yeah, we, we did it in his um, studio, which is just pretty much down the road from our place on the Gold Coast in Australia. Um, so, yeah, we collaborated with him and um, wrote this album that we were really proud of, yeah. Now, you're both from Australia. You spend a lot of time, you know, surfing and backpacking. So, what is your connection, nature inspiring, you know, with your music? You were talking about nature really mm -hmm. inspires your music. Yeah, I think, like, just growing up, there's, like, a really big culture in Australia for traveling mm -hmm. and exploring nature. And, like, we live right by the ocean. So, it's, like, it's something that... Um, it's just yeah, a big part of our culture, just getting out and like being in nature. And so when we started writing music, we just kind of wrote about experiences that we'd had growing up, traveling up and down the East Coast. And um, I think it just naturally came out and the things that we wrote about. Um, yeah, there's just, there's something about spending time in nature that just like kind of stills you and, yeah. and focuses you onto the beauty of the world. And so when we were writing, we wanted to kind of do that through our music as well. No, it's true. So many people talk about how being in nature just helps their mental health. Yeah. So mm -hmm. it's so important. You guys are performing all across the U.S. this summer, including some really special performances inside national parks. Yeah. So tell us a little about that. Yeah, so one of the really special ones is um, in Zion National Park. So we're doing... Um, playing three songs with the national park being the background and wow. getting it's all getting filmed and we are, we're making a video segment out of it so it's such a um, special place the um, Zion National Park we've been there before and yeah it's it's great now besides the um, fundraising you know how do you hope that your music inspires people to get outside and to put the parks and, and environment mm -hmm. yeah so I think like every time we've come to the states mm -hmm. we always make time to just stop in at the national parks just because we're like these places are incredible yeah. and so when we got to do this partnership with the national parks foundation we were like it just makes so much sense because we we're going to be visiting these parks anyway um but yeah i think we just want to point people towards the beauty that we have like on this mm -hmm. planet and um just like create awareness that if we're not protecting these places we're going to lose something so special yeah. and so i think through our music through this mm -hmm. partnership we're just trying to like point people into how beautiful this world is and yeah i love what you're doing all right i have to ask you new york city not that we're like the nature you know <laughs> thing, but what do, what do you like about new york city because you guys have been here about four times yeah okay tell yeah. me is there anything that you really like about it <laughs> honestly the people are so interesting like <laughs> there's so That's many very diplomatic there's so many characters like the people watching here is probably some of the best in the world <laughs> <laughs> That's true. How about you? What do you? What stands out to you? I think the food. Like mm. you can pretty much every time you come here, you can go to somewhere new. Um, Is there just, anything that you really like that you've tried in New York? Like one of those hot dogs on the streets or anything? Uh, <laughs> what uh, have you had? I think I had like actually really good sushi last oh, time. Oh, excellent! I forget where it was, but yeah, I think I. I, I know it's not. Like no, a, no, no, a standard no, 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 I'm, I just am always interested, especially since you guys are so environmental in nature, this yeah. is, you know, it's a little different mm -hmm. here, yeah. but I'm so glad you visited us. Thank yeah. you. Oh, and pleasure. thank you for the work that you're doing, because you're not just making music, you're making a big difference. Yeah, no, thanks so much. You're welcome. All right, so you can see Hollow Coves. It's live this Saturday in Brooklyn at the Warsaw.